Hello everyone and welcome back to the MRA League Season 2 Qualifiers. Today we have Funnel Endurance with our four groups here today. And we're already starting here with Group A. So the goal of this event is to stay the most up top of all the group. You have to be the last one to finish the race. So for example, Campfire is not doing a great job so far. And as we look more at the back of the pack, we have a great job here by Mermaid, Lion, and Gorilla. Campfire just dropping like a fly. It's not looking good for him. But if we look more at the middle pack, we have a lot of marbles that need to do well, like Purity and Champagne. If they do a great job here, they could have a great chance at making the final round of this qualifiers. Ghost Plasma now falling in. Ghost Plasma who wasn't even good in a race, normal type race in funnels because he was already doing it too long and now he's just going fast in it. I just don't understand how he is able to do this. If we continue on the rest of the race, we have Blazing Turbo and Neptune at the back. And in the lead, we have still Mermaid. We have also Beach Ball in second. And as the marbles are already coming in onto the penultimate funnel right now. And by the way, sorry if you hear my voice. I've been uh, dealing with sickness uh, this past week. So my voice is a bit shaky and a bit... Uh, Rusty, must I say. And as we enter the final section of this race, as we get our first finishers, Campfire, who is gonna just grab two points, tied in 15, the newcomer, not a great job. Also for Blazing Turbo and Ghost Plasma. So those marbles are all gonna get two points. And then Neptune, Sparkling Water are all getting six points with Haze. And now as we look more at the top, Speeder is beginning to have a battle for fourth. Gorilla is here also, Beach Ball has fallen down the order and he is now at the back, he is now only going to finish in 5th but still a great performance with 12 points, Speeder in 4th, who is going to win it, is it going to be Lion, Mermaid in 3rd, here comes Gorilla in 2nd and your winner of this event, Lion. We're going to get a look at our podiums and our standings in third place, Mermaid, in second, Gorilla, and your winner, Lion. So now let's get a look at our standings for Group A. We have Speeder at the top here with 28 points, with Mermaid also with 28 points. Then we have Gorilla, Sparkling Water, Beach Ball, Neptune, Lion, Champagne, Purity, Golden Bloom, Blazing Turbo, Haze, Chocolate Bar, Ghost Plasma, Campfire, and Tide. As we're now going to head on to our Group B. So here comes the Group B. And they're off. After a slight misstep from the officials, the race has begun. And already spot with an awful start. And here comes the rest of the gang. At the top we have Blizzard doing great so far. The blue marble in the yellow funnel. And he is in the lead. Spot just dropping like a fly. It's not looking good for him. As we're looking more at what the race could develop, it's a 10 funnel race. What an intense race because it's a long race. If you are, if you have a bad start, if you can recover uh, before the halfway point, which is marked by the white funnel, if you can recover before this, you still have a chance. Like for example, Spot is just doing awful so far. But in the lead at the top, only, only in the second funnel, it's gonna be Soul of Darkness. What an incredible job! As he's just skimming the edge of this red funnel, while we already have Spot in the penultimate. This is a disastrous performance by Spot, but what a great one by Soul of Darkness in his new uniform. As last year he was in the MRE League, can he be this year? As we have our first finisher, which is without a doubt Spot. 
and I think you're good, just gonna get the two points and just get out of it because it was an awful race for him. As we look more at the back of the pack in 15, it's gonna be jungle, jungle, not a great one. If you want to make it to the final round, you don't have to do this performance. And then we have Zeus, Zebra, Blueberry Bomb, Zebra who won the last event is now uh, falling behind because he only got six points. It's a it's a really intense competition. If you just have one misstep, it could be the end of it. Black Hole in sixth. Great job by him, the newcomer. Lava in fifth. So Soul of Darkness going as slow as he can to keep his lead. Oceanic in fourth. Here comes Samurai. Is Samurai gonna finish third? Yes, he is. First podium in his career. And then we have Blizzard with another first podium in his career. And finally, Soul of Darkness, your winner of this event in Group B. So the podium, we have Samurai in third, Blizzard in second, and your winner, Soul of Darkness. What a great job by those three marbles. Let's get a look at our standings in Group B. Lava is gonna take the lead with 29 points. Then we have Zebra, Soul of Darkness, Black Hole, Water, Blizzard, Samurai, and Quicksand rounds up the top 8. Then we have Blueberry Bomb, Blue Chocolate, Zeus, Oceanic, Spot, Flaming Scorpion, Tropical Freeze, and Jungle. So now let's get a look at our Group C. As we are already halfway done in this event. And they are off. Who is going to go to a bad start? It's going to be Blue Cobra at the beginning. And if you look at the back of the pack, now so far, Rocky doing a great job, Latte doing a great job, and also for Cappuccino. And now Gecko is going to be at the back, but Shooting Star and them are not doing a great job. Alien in the leaders, and also for Pumpkin King. As we look at them, Summer Sky with Yeti, I think. Yeah, Yeti, and then the Skeleton Skipper and Swift Current. Galaxy is in sec. I think Galaxy is the third marble to go into the halfway point of this race. Is he gonna be? No, he's gonna be the second one going to the halfway point. He's not doing great, Galaxy. This could be the falling point of him. Galaxy doing well in climb ups always, but in the MRA League, he always fails to do something great. At the top here, we have a great performance by Pumpkin King and Cappuccino. Lati has fallen down a bit the order and he's now in the like middle pack of this race. Summer Sky with a great recovery. Summer Sky who was in the bottom tree at the beginning and he is now falling down. Which is a great, a great thing you want in Funnel Endurance. And as we see, Yeti in the final funnel of this race. Is he gonna make it in last? No, Rocky, who was in the lead at the beginning of the race, he is now battling for his life and he's gonna finish in 15. What a, what a, I don't know what to say. This was just, he had a super great start, but just ended it at the end poorly. This was a disastrous second sector for him. And as you see, Banana Striker and Shooting Star coming in. Swift Gerwin, who just clenches up top eight. Then we have Summer Sky in 7th, Latte is going to finish in 6th. And then Deep Blue, who I didn't talk about in this race, is just going to finish in 5th. What a great race by him. And also for Alien, Alien giving him chances of making it. We also have Parrotfish in 3rd. And it's going to be Pumpkin King in 2nd. And your winner, Cappuccino. Awesome race by him. And as we're going to look at this podium, this was a great performance for some and what a downfall for some others like Galaxy and Rocky in third, Parrotfish in second, Pumpkin King and your winner, Cappuccino. So let's get a look at our standings for Group C. We have Pumpkin King in the lead with 32 points. This is a great uh, point collection for him. We, then we have Cappuccino, Banana Striker, the blue parrotfish, shooting star, latte, summer sky, alien, galaxy, yeti, blue cobra, swift current, skeleton skipper, rocky, and gecko. And by the way, while you're here, please subscribe. It's gonna help me make some content as we're going for group D.
and we are up in the final group of those qualifiers in the funnel endurance as we go anarchy with not a great start but i think he's gonna be able to recover as we look at him he's not he's sort of doing a great job and as the marbles roll down to the final section slowly but surely iceberg with a great job so far As we look more at the bottom of the pack, we have Ice and Riptide. And as the marbles fall down, we have Mint joining the joining the party at the back. But in the front, we have a lot a lot of newcomers doing a great job. Iceberg is one of them doing a great job. Silk Touch is also doing great. Mistletoe is one of them also. I'm just saying all the marbles that are in the lead, they're all newcomers. This is a great job by them. And as the marbles go down slowly onto the final section of this race. Some marbles like Cherry Mist I, I see in the battle for last place. He has to keep his head up and not finish there. We have also Flamethrower in this sort of like party. And we also have Tic Tac and Mint, two MRA League racers, and Mint is gonna fall off. Uh, not Mint, Tic Tac is gonna fall off. And then comes Flamethrower. And what is this? Looks like Flamethrower is stuck on the track. We're gonna try to remove it. It's not gonna work. So we're gonna have a stoppage. And look at this. This is beginning to get. And this is not supposed to happen. Look at this. All the marbles are getting stuck at the entry of the funnel. So since Flamethrower caused the problem, I think he's gonna get two points. This is the least the committee could do. And I think we're just gonna restart from this. Yeah, like I, I see in the bottom left corner. This is just where we're gonna start. And this is already starting. And full punch getting 14. And this is gonna be just the intense final section. And as the normal roll down, eight, seven, six, and fifth iceberg. For Silk Touch in second, Snake's Eye. And look at this, Green Warner is gonna be your winner. Anarchy finishing in second. The, I think the this final section that got stopped for Flamethrower was a downfall for him. And here looks Snake Eye, Snake's Eye. Anarchy and Green Warrior are your podium. It's just going too fast. I don't know what to say. Let's get a look at our standings of Group D. We have Green Warrior with 40 points which is the maximum point he can have so far he's doing such a great job then we have ice mint mistletoe sky snake's eye anarchy iceberg riptide silk touch water dragon fruit punch cherry mist nitro tic tac and flamethrower so now see you next time where we're gonna finish the third round of those qualifiers with the downhill sprint so see ya in two weeks